the Upper Clearwater Valley lends itself to deer trails because it's a place that hasn't been greatly affected by human activity and uh, natural processes continue today as they have for tens of thousands of years. Therefore, we can follow the ways of the deer, the mind of the deer. And we can see organisms interacting ever since uh, humans began to create our civilization. Come and be an expert in a tiny little place, and you'll become the world expert in the swamp. The exercise of mapping is to get people in a really juicy place and sit still for a while and observe and try and make some kind of sense of this very complex world. They'll have a tool they can take with them anywhere, to their backyard, to their kids' schoolyard, to working with community about conserving places. When you start interacting with the natural world on an intimate level that field journaling requires, it opens you up to be changed by the world. When we take the time to see particular details, we can sink down into a place and open ourselves to it. Attachment breeds care, and care breeds better action on that place and with that place.